Welcome here to Talk FCB and welcome back here to the channel guys and welcome back to career mode at long last it does return here is episode 13 for you guys and following this there will also be episode 14 straight after so two episodes in one day to make up for all the time that we haven't spent doing this series but if you have forgotten anything from the previous episodes here is a brief summary of what went down in episode 12 hopefully with those we can get the goals to get us in this game Banega 2-0 Sevilla, all of our plans shattered as Sevilla come out in the second half and get their second goal of the game. Suarez looking for a give and go with Denis, but Denis might have a goal on his own and he only takes about a minute to have an immediate impact. Denis Suarez coming off the bench with an absolutely brilliant goal from outside the box. 4-1 Barcelona and in today's episode we are going to be playing Sporting Lisbon in the Champions League and then on the weekend we are going to be playing Valencia in La Liga and now I'm going to rest some players in this sporting class simply because if you do look at the group standings we are comfortably clear in the Champions League ahead of Juve, ahead of Sporting, technically a point would see us safely through to the next round even losing wouldn't be the end of the world so I'm going to make a few changes and bring in some young faces and when I said make changes I really did mean it here we we got Ter Stegen, Cucurella in at left back, Antonio and PK still the experience there at centre back, and Semedo as well from the right. But Roberto and Samba holding in that midfield, Correa to the left, Alenia through the middle, and I've left Luis Suarez and Dembele in there just for a bit of firepower. And of course, if things do go badly wrong, we have got players like Messi on the bench as well. Well, but here we go then for the Champions League, this. Sporting Champions against Champions Barcelona. I really hope these players that we put in today, the likes of Alenia, yeah. Correa, those so kind of young players can really grasp so this opportunity and play done. well. We Sporting are about now, to find okay. out. Hopefully Barcelona. we can get over the line in this one. Here's Suarez with an early interception there. Running straight at Sporting. We've not taken much time here at all. Suarez there with the finish. Ah, that wasn't good. That was not good. But a really good start though. Suarez pressing from the front, but unfortunately ballooning that finish over the bar good challenge there by Sampa and again now we've got a little bit of a break opportunity here's Correa on to Luis Suarez just taken away from him there though Dembele into Suarez Dembele will continue his run Suarez will pick him out Dembele we have the lead who's man Dembele once again in the Champions League he has been so so good during this career mode and we do have the lead just 15 minutes gone Suarez and Dembele combining it's 1-0 Right on the spot Dembele score. here looking for the return there. That's a really good pass in Suarez. I didn't know if I'd make that one. Dembele in on goal there, though. Never, ever going to miss. Really good goal and so good to take the lead. Even with our young guys out on the pitch today. 15 minutes gone. We have the lead. And Teddy will deal with that one. It's very much so far long balls from Sporting. We've dealt with pretty comfortably here. Suarez again Suarez. bursting into space. Dembele is with him again as well. Suarez into Dembele. Lays it off to Carlos Alenia. Oh, it's just blocked. I thought he was going to be in there to score his first goal. So unlucky. Nothing doing there. Sporting again just giving the ball back. And we will go again. This time into Sampa. Sergio Roberto. Correa is going to have Alenia down the line. Cucurella, who can pick him out. That's a really good ball from Cucurella. Alenia into space. He's going to cut it back. It's Luis Suarez. It is 2 0. And it's a wonderful goal again. Fantastic play. Carlos Alenia, very unselfish. And Suarez gets himself on the score sheet in the Champions League. Nicely done though from back to front very very quickly Cucurello with the ball to Alenia cuts it back Suarez steadies himself takes a touch and finishes it past Rui Patricio to give us a 2-0 lead in this first half. Nicely done Alenia approaching half time now with Sambo this will be the last action of the half and that is half time 2-0 Barcelona very comfortable really good display from the young guns and our experienced pair of Suarez and Dembele it's 2-0 here we go then for the second half no changes as of yet but I might make some as the game goes on but really what we've been doing is very good with the players we've got on the pitch and it's 2-0 and we're very comfortable and hopefully we can add to that here in this second half Here's Correa, looking now for Cucurella. He's got players in the middle. That's a really good ball as well. Cucurella, considering I think his rating is 68. He has been so good in this game. Really not at all looking like a 68 player. He'll deal with this one as well, and he does. Roberto into Correa. Now on to Suarez. He'll 
Hold it up and wait for reinforcements. Now Sampa finds Dembele. On to the attack now. Looking for Alenia. Alenia! Oh, oh, he's so close. I thought that again. He's, he's been so close to his first goal. It was a great hit there from Alenia. Deserving of a goal, but it cannons off the crossbar. Piquet coming across, getting the ball. Wonderful tackle there from the captain today, Gerard Piquet. Oh, it's a great ball as well for Dembele. He's running into space now. That's not going to be a foul. And they cut it out. Alenia finding Dembele. Dembele. He has all the space in the world to run into. He's got options as well. He's got Suarez with him. Here's Suarez. Roberto. Cucurella. Picks it back off to Suarez. Now Dembele. It's going to be a free kick well, there. Cohen Schrauer giving it away on no, Dembele. And we will it's have a, chance, a chance now. At least work the goalkeeper. Suarez from the free kick. Oh, it's a wonderful goal. Really is from Luis Suarez. Directly from the free kick. He doesn't usually, of course, get a chance with Messi over them. But Suarez rifling that one into the top corner. Barcelona 3. Sporting Lisbon nil here. Touched in off the post. Wasn't far out, had a little look, did his nice little run. That's a wonderful goalkeeper, never a chance with that one. Great strike from Suarez, always liked to score free kick goals, and that was a nice one. I'm just going to bring on Denny Suarez here in replacement of Usman Dembele, who's been absolutely brilliant, and some much needed game time for Denny's here. Bringing him on just off down that right hand side, not his fully natural position, but he can certainly do a job there. We're 3 0 up, we're fine. Here. By the way, the are going Good forward. football there from Sporting and they do have one back. Really nice play around the edge of the box. They're just passing it around one touch there. Good play and a good finish. They are back in this but not really. 3-1 we're still comfortable and we shouldn't have given that away but it is what it is. 3-1 right now. Let's try and get another one to just put this out of sight. Sporting coming again here. And another goal for Sporting. It's 3-2. Very sort of similar. It's a finish that's a bit higher in the net. They did well again in and around the box. We're not really defending it right. Doss laying it off. And a really good finish past Joe Stegen. But got to be careful now because we're giving away two pretty easy goals. Let's try and hold on to what we have. Roberto into Suarez. Takes a touch away from the defender. Suarez straight at the goalkeeper. Just a few minutes now. To go in this game was very comfortable, still is quite comfortable, but well, the not as great now. a scoreline as we were possibly hoping improve. for. Still in with a shout. Here's Correa. Yeah, time is now Alenia. He's been so close to a first goal here today. Oh, careful now, well, careful now. We do not want to concede goal. another one. Kikarella's got, got to get there, he does. Samba into Denise. That should be enough to get the points here. This will be the last attack of the game. And the referee calls time on it. Another win in the Champions League. Three goals to do over Sporting Lisbon. Even though we played a significantly weaker side than usual. We are now through to the last 16. And we're going to have to wait and see. Until we play our last game, of course, we won't know who we get in the group. But whoever we get, we will feel like we can compete with. And as we spoke about earlier on, guys, now we do have that vital away game at Valencia in La Liga. You can see here, there really is no room at all for error. We're top of the league by just one point ahead of Real Madrid, just one point ahead of Sevilla as well. Valencia are down there in sixth. But we all know, trip to the Mestalla are not easy. I'm going to play the best possible team that I can do in this one. What I have done here though is go with a very, very attack minded lineup. I wanted to maybe play with Iniesta in that 10 position and Messi a bit further forward and then play Jorginho at the base of that midfield. But what I thought we'd do is play Suarez because he was so, so good. And Dybala, Dembele and Messi, that is a fantastic quartet there. Can they make it happen against Valencia? Here we go then for Valencia against Barcelona. It is at the Mestalla and it is going to be a really, really good game. There is no room for error, like I say, at the top of the league. We have to win this to stay there, absolutely no doubt about that. We do have the best goal difference in the league. We do have the best points right now, but will that be the case after this trip? to Valencia. Here's Dembele early on now into Iniesta. A lot of these players of course have the luxury of being rested 
in that midweek game against Sporting. That's exactly why I did it, because we will need them in this game. We got through the Sporting game without any problems anyway. So hopefully we can continue that kind of form in this new formation, which has worked really, really well so far. Hopefully that continues. Just waiting for spaces to appear. Valencia there with two banks of four. Iniesta. Suarez. Messi. Suarez again. Luis Suarez. Ooh, that wasn't too far away there. And I said he's been brilliant. Really, really good in the last game against Sporting. And this is a good effort early on. Suarez just bending it there. Not quite low enough, but that's not far wide. And he has to know. Valencia just went forward, so there might be a chance to just hit them a little bit there. Couldn't get through. It's Pereira. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. Dembele, Sergio Busquets now across to Jordi Alba, he's got a bit of space to work in here, he's got Messi inside of him, just haven't quite got going yet, not really putting enough passes together, not stringing together enough moves, finding Suarez, Messi's close to him, Lionel Messi, just blocked off, but that's kind of what we want to do there, just bring Suarez into the game, Messi can float around off him, then maybe find a bit of space on the edge of the box and we can do something with that. Messi coming back to win it now Dembele's down the right Suarez looking to pick him up he might just have done that really good ball there from Suarez Dembele cutting back Suarez with the ball in towards Dybala punched by the goalkeeper this gets doing well Messi into Iniesta Iniesta here driving at Valencia Suarez into Messi, Suarez continuing his run, so will Lionel Messi, Messi cutting in on his left and Messi scoring against Valencia on the brink of half time and what a goal that was with that fantastic left foot, brilliant build up play, Suarez and Messi combining, that's where you want Messi just in that bit of space there, wraps his foot around it and what a goal, past Valencia before they knew it, just before half time as well, what a fantastic time to score. Messi again here, we're into added time in this first half. And that is half time. Barcelona 1, Valencia 0 here, courtesy of that man, of course it was, Lionel Messi. Here we go then for the second half in this one. Hopefully we can continue exactly what we started at the end of that first half. A really good performance in general, quite solid, not too many chances. That's why it was so important to make that breakthrough through Lionel Messi. And Tilly finding Busquets. Suarez has been really, really important in this game. Just dropping in, holding up the ball and just bringing other players into it, whether it be Dembele or Messi. Here comes Messi. Iniesta now on the edge. He can have a go from there. Iniesta always rising, but I just want to score one of those goals and just create the Iniesta Chelsea moment, to be perfectly honest. Iniesta just waiting for options. Messi into Suarez. Again, Suarez just looking for Messi, finds him, Messi away from his man, oh, it's down off the bus bar, but Dembele, he's done it just about, there we get the goal, Messi deserved it, brilliant play again between him and Suarez, it comes out to Dembele, and we won't begrudge him that goal, brilliant finish it was, we get the second goal, and that could be colossal. Little ball there, Messi's in, really good hit, cannons off the crossbar, Dembele on his left foot, we know he's but good on both sides, and he just finishes it on the volley, into the back of the net, Barcelona 2, Valencia 0. And I'm going to bring off Paolo Dybala and bring on Joaquin Correa, I thought Correa played pretty well in the first game against Sporting in this episode, also I didn't really think Dybala did much in this game, on the left hand side, his runs weren't great, he wasn't really coming to get the ball, so just a little change here at 2-0. And hopefully we can continue this because it's been good so far. Correa into Messi, finding Dembele the goal scorer. Up to Luis Suarez. He deserves a goal for his work in this game. Really, really impressive once again from Suarez. Messi into Busquets. Messi will have it back though. Messi has a bit of space. Lionel Messi! Oh, he's at the bar again! What is going on? What a strike that was again from Messi. Cannon in across the bar and he's so unlucky not to get another goal. Just lost a little bit of focus here. Valencia dominated the last sort of 10, 15 minutes. They've been pretty decent, had a few chances, and, and you know, we've got to keep focusing this game up. They do say, you know, 2 0 is a dangerous scoreline for this specific reason. You know, you think you're comfortable, you think you're, you're way ahead, but we still need to concentrate here and try and get another one if we can. Messi in a load of room here, and when Messi is in this much space, you have to make the opposition pay. He gives it to Joaquin Correa. Suarez is there again. Suarez! Good save. I just didn't get enough power on it there. To make a Here's Busquets, Iniesta, Iniesta, took the deflection, what have we got about this crossbar, Correa, gosh, 
What's going on? We are addicted to this crossbar. Condogbia though. Condogbia. Oh, Valencia have a bit of our own medicine there. Off the post. See how it feels, guys. See how it feels. Now this is an interesting attack. Good work, really, to read the... Well, for Suarez, lay off there for Guerrero. We've got two minutes to go here. Suarez, he's got Messi arriving. He picks out Messi. Messi on his right foot. Shouldn't matter, though. Messi! Oh! Oh! That's three times. Two of them for Messi. And, and I... I <laughs> Good job it's 2-0, because if this was 0-0, I think I would have headbutted the screen by now. Into added time now. Still 2-0 up, still comfortable. Still, of course, going to stay now top of the league, and that's the most important thing. It's been a good display here against Valencia. We've done everything we had to do. Two good goals, two very well worked goals, and should have been more as well if it wasn't for the woodwork. But that is a big win. 2 0 at the Mastaya, and you can see the celebration. So that is that for this episode, guys. In this episode, we qualified for the Champions League knockout stages. Well done there. We stayed top of the league with a really good win over Valencia. And please do join me later on for the next episode. That'll be episode 14 coming up as soon as I possibly can after I upload this episode, because what we're going to be doing in that episode is potentially a big comeback. We are currently 3-1 down in the Copa del Rey to Girona. It's away from home. 3-1 on the night will take it to extra time. A 3-0 clear win would take us to the next round. But we're going to be seeing if we can make that comeback happen. And we will also be facing Juventus in the last Champions League game before the knockout stage takes place. So please do join me later on for all of that and more. Thank you as always guys for joining me here for Career Mode. I really do hope that you enjoyed it and I hope you enjoyed the new feature of the face on the screen. Let me know your thoughts and your comments down below, guys. I'll see you later. But until then, as always, Beska El Barca.